you're going to return taking nine more heel to toe steps. Yes, Ellis County Jail and walk to Hatch. The woman who falsely accused a Texas Department of Public Safety trooper of sexual assault after she was pulled over for apparent drunk driving could face charges, according to the Ellis County District Attorney. Ellis County Jail and walk to Hatch. Sharita Dixon Cole accused DPS trooper Daniel Hubbard of forcefully groping her in a sexual assault inside and outside of his cruiser. Her claims were shared more than 50,000 times online, thanks to posts by Dixon Cole's attorney and social activist Sean King. But the two hour dash cam footage released Tuesday night shows no sign of wrongdoing. It shows Hubbard administering multiple field sobriety tests, removing two bottles of alcohol from her and spotting what he believes is an alcoholic drink in a cup holder. I see an officer who conducts himself exactly as society demands police conduct themselves today, beyond reproach, Ellis County DA Patrick Wilson said. Tragically, that officer still was publicly and maliciously persecuted. What happened to that officer is a shame. Wilson said his office is investigating the possibility of charges against Dixon Cole. He says there was no apparent motive for the claims and he is flabbergasted as to how this story came out. When I went to the DPS office to watch the video, I fully expected to see some measure of tension or aggravation between the officer and the woman being arrested, he said. The world has now seen that there is nothing of the sort on that video. DPS said it was appalled that anyone would make such despicable, slanderous and false accusations against a peace officer. Filing a false police report is a Class B misdemeanor in Texas, according to Section 37.08 of the Texas Penal Code.